Hey folks, welcome back to Let's Play Red Dead Redemption 2 Undead Nightmare. I'm the Mysterious JG. Uh, the game just doesn't want us to have nice things. It keeps tempting me. Like, there's a flower here. We need those for this quest we're on. But the game is really, really trying to get me to screw up and kill myself. Um, so let's try not to give the game its sinister desire in this case. I need to find a way back to a road so that uh, the navigation will work. Wait, what? I had a retro on my horse. Where did it go? What the hell happened? I swear, like, I just... I, I took a sip of tea and started recording again after I recorded the last video where we had one of those on our horse. This game keeps finding ways to fucking glitch out and screw me. We had the thing. What's making this quest so difficult is that the game keeps f fucking glitching. Like, I get the thing on my horse and... Oh, did I hit the... Did I whistle for it at some point and not realize it? Did I just, like, sub... Like, subconsciously trying to get the horse to be closer and easier to board? Like... See, there's always retchers in a group this big somewhere. But, um... Yeah, you can't really deal with having this many guys in a group. Because it's it makes it really difficult to actually, and then again, I didn't actually see any retros either. You, you can't always tell real well what kind they are. It's like if you actually, if you actually get noticed by them and starts, and one of them starts firing on you, you can kind of keep track. But it's sometimes they just kind of look like regular, and then. They start spitting the green stuff. They don't always have, like, really noticeable green bits. I appear to have found the only large group of zombies in the game in the Gap Tooth Ridge that doesn't include a retcher of any kind. Yeah, this is really getting on my nerves. This is getting old. And I'd set the, uh, I'd s There's no point in following it now, because I don't have the retcher. Ah. Oh. Finally, things were looking up again at the end of the video, and then this happens. This game just keeps screwing me. It's, you know, I was saying, it's it's fairly lengthy for a DLC. It's not very long for a standalone game, but one way to artificially increase the length of a game is to have uh, the game keep fucking breaking every time you're trying to make progress. Oh, you've done better, Rockstar. This is not... I mean, what kind of playtesting did they do? No, oh, I'm fucking... Het The headless glitch again. Like, literally everything that we did in that last video has been undone. That entire last video, which I'm going to keep and I'm going to post and I'm not going to edit it out and just let you guys see just how freaking rotten this game can be. Everything we did in that last video um, doesn't count. It's, you know, it doesn't, doesn't matter. Because the game just glitched, and we just and I, I don't want to save the game while it's in that glitch state. So I'm gonna throw away the three flowers we picked up. At this point, we picked up more than the total number of flowers we need. I'm not bothering to use the survivalist map because the flowers are showing up, and um, I keep getting caught up. Like like if the game is forcing me to spend time in Gap Tooth Ridge anyway, I'm gonna try to take care of this this optional side quest that's out there. 
I know I'm not gonna do all the survivalist challenges and stuff, but anything that actually has like dialogue and, and stuff, I wanna do. It's So How do I keep finding all these ways for this game to explode? Nope, it's like it's one thing that the un you know, the undead obviously aren't gonna have a lot of commentary on the fact that you're riding this flaming death horse death horse, it's war's horse, but I would think like other people might be like, whoa, dude. Any of you guys happen to be wretchers? Hmm. No wretchers in this group? And why are, okay, there is a wretcher. Why are they It's like they're they're working together with frickin' um Oh, I think the wretcher might have gotten killed. It's like they're working together with the coyotes now all of a sudden. Okay, that one is a wretcher. This one is a wretcher. No, it's not. It's the little weird. There was a wretcher, and I was pretty careful not to uh, set it on fire, but I guess I accidentally set it on fire because suddenly there's no wretcher. I'm not going to start wasting bullets until one of these guys shoots green projectile stuff at me. Because, and if I if it does, I'll pull out a gun and get rid of the rest using a gun. But um. It isn't happening, so forget it. And again, I'm not making any progress either on finding flowers now. So he's upset that I don't want to give him ammo. And, well, I mean, I guess it. I don't know, whatever. I could just. Oh, well, here's an actual flower. He's like, no, I don't do the shooting challenge bet things. Coyote just kind of moseyed on up to me there. Apparently, he killed quite a few enemies. None of whom I seem to be allowed to loot. Even though they're all marked on the map, they're corpses. More than happy to rob you as well. You're joking. Yeah, whatever. Man, you I don't know, you know, even, even though I'm being a big coward about the shooting challenges, this game is gonna f just fucking glitch as soon as you get going anyway, but... Okay, this camera angle is not doing me a lot of favors here. Little 
Why am I bothering at this? Because I thought there was a wretcher in the group. There might still be a wretcher around here somewhere. Although, again, sometimes... I don't know if they have less hit points or are more susceptible to burning, but... I keep accidentally killing them while trying to keep them alive. And again, I'm not finding any of the damn flowers that I need. I got one so far in this run. Let's go. Hmm. The flowers don't seem to spawn at the rate the zombies do. Where you've got one by itself, everything's great, and suddenly there's a million of them. Cueva, Cueva Seca. Seca! Any retchers in this group? Well, there's definitely... Oh, there's a bunch of retchers in this group. love to get up on top of one of these rocks, but it's not going to work like that, it looks like. Well, I've definitely got multiple wretchers to work with in this group. explode and kill the rest? No, he left one alive. It's actually more than one still alive, but... Shut up! <laughs> I'll really give you something to drone about. Yeah. You guys who are still actively murdering me, shut up! get you on the horse and then I have to like pathologically avoid touching the button that would potentially I guess they're upset that I'm kidnapping their friend I mean that makes sense right stay there. just stay there man now, you don't need to be causing me problems now friend Where'd my horse go? If I whistle for it, I will lose the victim. I might lose the victim even without whistling for it. I'm not 100% sure how that works. And there's a part of me that suspects that carrying a victim around on a burning horse might cause that victim to eventually, you know, burn. What's it feel like to burn? It burns, brother. All right. I have the victim on the horse. I must not, under any circumstance... We already had that little cutesy dialogue in one of the many, many efforts at this where I had to load and lose the progress. Okay. I must not get off the horse and whistle for it because either the game just flat out glitched or that's what happened before. Let's see, that might be Famine's horse. Or I guess, it's, I guess there's just generically undead horses you can get. Because I... We haven't had an encounter with one of the four horses of the apocalypse since I caught one. But I would think it would still work the same way. We would be told that a mythical creature was nearby. A new species of creature has entered your dungeon. Okay, so we finally have this thing. I'm not... I'm going to get into the general area of the town and then 
walk the rest of the way without riding the horse in so that I can accidentally kill the mission giver with my fiery horse. Just careful, careful. Then I'll definitely save the game. And we'll still have a bunch of flowers to pick, but at least that's all. Like, I can just ignore or avoid zombies. I don't have to try to capture a wretcher, which is really slowing things down, obviously. Game just did not want me to have this. It kept finding ways to screw me over. I don't even want to pause, because I feel like I paused, and then when I unpaused... I no longer had the Wretcher on my horse. We spent half a video now getting back something that I had at the end of the previous video. We were all ready to go. How close are we? Okay. I was about to try to, to ride across on a shortcut, but let's not do that. And let's really hope this place isn't under attack, because that would mess things up completely. Carry victim. Put away the gun so I'm not accidentally shooting someone. I think I can run. I don't think I have the ability to run into someone to death. That's him. Like, he wasn't even dead. He was still walking around, and for some reason... For this, for some reason, they said the quest was failed. Even though the guy seemed to be fine. Ah, oh, Mr. Marson! I see art has got the better of you. Stupidity got the better of me, but... <laughs> yeah, the glitch has got the better of me a lot. I appreciate that, sir. Are you ready to watch the creation of magic? Can't you believe you we are so. magic? Wow. Let's put the star into his first scene. This is going to end right with you being killed by the zombie, isn't it? Yeah. I hope I get some kind of reward for this. Infinite survivalist maps or something. Lovely. This is a love story, these two zombies? We don't even try to help him. Sometimes I think I've been drugged. Like, what was the point of that quest? No, I can't freaking die now. Oh, now now he's undead too. Great. From him? Okay. Because I want to. I got to mug the uh, dead director. Or not mug, but uh, search his corpse. Because that might be the only semblance of a reward for doing this. This So this was. This was a stupid side quest. Uh, it was a pain in the ass. Partly because of glitching. And partly just because of weird enemy spawning uh, things. It doesn't look like he even left a corpse that I can. So I got no reward for it, and, uh, like, I called the wacky zany ending, like, a million miles away. <sighs> but, you know. It's trying to be a completionist, you know. Just trying to kind of vaguely, softly belch as I let's play, so, you know, like you do.
Ah, well. That's the only side quest that was left to be done, and we've done it. If there's... Did this game just freaking break again? Seriously? Oh my god. I mean, it's not funny anymore. It's like. It's a. This game is a broken piece of shit, and I'm really disappointed. I mean, I'm playing Red Dead Redemption. It shouldn't be an option down here. It crashed as it was saving. So we'll see if uh, it actually took as a save slot or not. I will, I'm curious if this actually took... It did an auto save, and then I was attempting a manual save. So I'm thinking the worst. It should have auto saved, right? Because I finished a quest. So I'm thinking the worst case scenario is the manual save isn't working and it loads an auto save. But, I mean, honestly, that was a weird auto save because we were being attacked by zombies. But yeah, this is. I mean, what the hell, Rockstar? This this game was released. You, it, it wasn't just a DLC you could go out and purchase. It was also something that you would like. You could go buy the disc for this in stores. As a matter of fact, I think eventually I. I think I'm playing off the Undead Nightmare disc. Like I bought it at some point, even though it was also a DLC. I think at some point, I think I, I think I just noticed it was. I just didn't want to waste the hard drive space when I saw that it came out. I think I, I might have just become aware that it came out when I saw it on a store shelf, even though I believe you could just order this as a... Well, okay, at, at least... So that was just the game, like, messing with me, because, uh... Nope, the manual save didn't take. The manual save did not take. This was, this was the autosave. So if we save our game on a manual slot here... Okay. Uh, how many more, um... How many more of these flowers do we need at this point? Desert... We only have one. Okay. So we do need to get back into Gap Tooth Ridge. Now that I can ignore the zombies, pretty much, um... I'll go ahead and use the survival map, because... Once we're ignoring the zombies, um... You know, Thor and uh, Blade and Mojo and Turk, the zombies. Once we're ignoring them, I'm a little more willing to use resources because, like, I would be, I would, it would bother me that the survivalist map, which gives you this temporary uh, ability to see stuff on your map, that the time on that would be counting down while we were, like, you know, fighting zombies who were trying to capture that one wrecker for that quest that was just oh so worthwhile. And again, I really need to stop trying to do any of these quests at night where you can't freaking see anything. Let's go. Repentance Rock. There's no, like, time limit on the game. So you've got, uh, John, um, no, you're John. You've got Is there any way to actually save this person? Doesn't look like... Doesn't seem likely that I can do it. Although, actually... It was starting to work out there. Oh, fuck. It actually worked. 
Do we get anything for that? Okay, we got six revolver ammo, which is actually less than I used. So that did work out. I'm not gonna bother to search them. I just don't care. I just... What's so crescent fresh about me, dudes, is that I just don't get it. So let's get to Gaptooth Ridge so that any plants that I detect with the survivalist map are actually going to be the ones we need. Benedict Cumberback Engelbert Slapdyback Ridge. Benedict Cumberbatch. Yeah. Fritz von Waller Ridge. Okay. Now we are in Gaptooth Ridge. So now we can use the Revivalist map. Oh, and suddenly they're everywhere. Okay, that's fine. I'm completely cool with that. That's the wrong kind of flower, though, isn't it? Oh, yeah, that's the wrong one. Shit. Just a minute ago, I saw two of them on the map. Does it really last that short an amount of time? No. I just got, I got exactly far enough away that I couldn't see it anymore is probably what happened. Okay, so if I can get to the top of this ridge, there's one up there. Come on. Oh, and there's one that I missed by climbing out of this ridge, so that there that gap, so that sucks. And uh, it looks like it wore no, it hasn't worn off yet. Well, it looks like I'm finding. Oh no, here we go. This is the right kind. This is Desert Sage. Might as well. Yep. Might as well indeed. to get two more. It would be nice if I can get them before this thing wears off. That would be really good. Uh, so I don't have to use two. Because that would mean I would have plenty left to use to get the violet uh, whatever. Horse does not want to go... I mean, you're not going to die from this fall, horse. Horse didn't want to deal with that. Oh, yeah, well, I can see. Okay, maybe. I'm not dead, but... I killed War's Steed? I guess I underestimated... I was trying not to go... I, I underestimated how far of a fall that was. Shit. I killed War. The Horse of War. Well, we'll see. I mean, if I... Um, if when I... F it's not going to let me summon it, and I'm thinking... The fact that it didn't immediately summon a new, uh, just generic horse suggests to me that I'm going to get that horse back. But wow, I killed, uh, the supernatural steed of, of war itself. I killed red hair. I'm pretty sure it's impossible in Dynasty Warriors. You can kill Lu Bu. You can't kill red hair. That's animal cruelty. You're not going to see that in a lot of video games. There we go. This is Wild That's Fever Few. That is not the one that I need. Maybe this will be a desert sage, in which case I will be done. That's the flower. That's the flower. Now I got flower power. Okay. Attracted an undead steed. So, I lost the burning super death horse. I can't, I mean, I can't keep that. <sighs> I think I need to 
step away from this game for a while. Part of me wants to just no, you know what? I'm gonna do I'm gonna do one more video because I think I can just not kill <laughs> the ultimate super burning death horse, which is supposed to be immortal, but apparently I'm still capable of killing it. If I do one more video where I efficiently use the survivalist map, I think I can get the the flowers and then have all this stuff behind me. So when we come back next time, that's what's going to happen. See you then.